Good morning, family. It is B. Brian Evans Unleashed here, and I am back for another day of our 30-day inspiration challenge. We are still rocking and rolling, moving throughout the month of August, dropping a video a day for your inspirational viewing and encouragement, and I just want to thank each and every one of you who have been rocking with me uh, so far. Those of you who have been commenting on the videos, I absolutely love hearing from you and responding and engaging with you. So please keep it up. If you want to like and share these videos, please do so as well. Um, and if you have not subscribed, please click that subscribe button and click the bell to be notified of all of my new inspirational content. I will be dropping daily here on B unleashed. So what are we talking about this morning? This morning I want to talk about friendship, um, relationships in general. Uh, I am, the older I get, learning the value of friendship and relationship more and more and on a deeper level. And um, just wanted to uh, share some, some uh, nuggets with you this morning. And um, wanted to, to really just kind of uh, play something on your mind to think about as it relates to your inner circle of friends. Um, I know we can't always choose who kind of comes into our lives or who cross our paths, um, but you can regulate how long they're there <laughs> and the engagement and the intensity um, with which they engage you and you engage with them. All right, and I think that's the, the most important thing as it relates to relationships. You really, first of all, want to know where you're going, okay? What is the vision for your life and how people fit into that frame, okay? Um, so I want to kind of give you some guidelines as it relates to uh, bringing people into your life and engaging people as they, you know, cross your path, all right? So... Uh, as it relates to friendship and your inner circle of people that you have around you, I want to give you uh, a guideline of, of three areas uh, where you want to uh, kind of make sure people are kind of aligning with your life. Okay, so three areas. First of all, can your friends or do your friends pray for you, okay? Do your friends in your inner circle, the people that you care about most, the people that care about you, do they pray for you? Are they able to contact God on your behalf? Okay, that's super duper valuable. If you have people in your life who can go to God on your behalf when you're weak, when you're discouraged, when you're down, depressed, anxious, or whatever, people that you can go to and talk to, and they know how to contact God in prayer on your behalf, you have a friend indeed. All right, keep those people around. Number two, can your friends praise you? Okay, when good things happen in your life, watch the people around you. Watch the people in your circle. How do they respond? How do they react to the good things going on in your life? Can they celebrate you? Do they rally around you and lift you up and promote you as their friend, okay, someone that they love and care about? All right, if they can't do that, then you may want to seriously reconsider having them in your inner circle because friends promote their friends, okay? They, they celebrate with their friends, all right? And the last thing, can they polish you? Can your friends challenge you? Can they push you to be better? Uh, the blemishes and the smudges, maybe in your character or, or in the way that you're doing things or your decisions, can you go to your friends and receive honest, truthful feedback? All right, in love, of course. <laughs> uh, but if you cannot receive these things from the people in your inner circle, you may want to seriously reconsider those individuals that you have close to you. All right. So I hope this was helpful. Just a little shot of inspiration. Listen, go out on this hump day 
and make today great. And remember to be bold, be yourself, be unleashed. Much love.